Hello friends and welcome back to the channel. I'm Handington and today we're continuing Bowser's Inside Story. Yes, if you skipped ahead four episodes, we have literally not gotten past the tutorial and it has been almost an hour. Because I am the slowest person to begin a game ever. So, we are now about to finally do it. We're going to start the game. Also, this game's startup time is actually very, very fast. Uh... Despite me taking a really long time, you get into the action pretty quickly. Here we go. Yay! And so it begins. Oh, I didn't get to sing the Dimble Woods song. Ah, uh, we'll be back here again. I'll sing it later. Oh boy. Look at him. It's the man of the hour. Hee <laughs> hee. I'm so excited. What? When what? Do 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 Mushrooms all moving around here. I love that little aesthetic. It's all just a little happy flare in the middle of the woods. <laughs> the customer has luck. And with luckiness comes a tasty lucky shroom. A lucky shroom? I didn't even buy anything. And there's tiny spinning mushrooms up on the top. What's this about jackpotting? Do not have worries for details. No, do not have the worries. Have the wonderful lucky shroom of tastiness instead. Scoff this down and your luck will power up to super luck. Or it's super luck, Kamek. What could go wrong with that? Luck enough to beat Mario. Never mind how I know that you know Mario. And uh, this seems very fishy, Bowser. Nonsense. It's enough for me to beat Mario. Beat Mario, seriously? I say to you, yes! With every attack, lucky hits will shower in a happy waterfall. You will have such fury. Your strongest enemies will fold like napkins who are crying. Your beefiness. Dude is weird. Don't eat that thing seriously. What? Didn't you hear him? It'll help me beat Mario. Duh. I'm not listening to you, Dad. Give me that shroom. I want shrooms in the forest. I think you're going to regret this. You, Weirdo, give me that lucky shroom. Oh yes, of course! Enjoy the eating! You got... <laughs> you got the lucky sh mushroom? I messed up the word there. <laughs> That's a double entendre! What, what, what does that mean? You'll never find out! Or will you? Just eat the mushroom. I'm gonna eat it in the middle of this field. Nom nom nom. Huh. Burf. Yeah, I told you that was a bad idea. What's wrong, your queasiness? 
And I told you not to stack on that snack on that thing. It was a snack attack. Hey you, creepy little weasel. What did you feed Bowser? Such easiness! So easy! It gives me the gleeful chortles! I have such strategy! And now for the leaving! You are having a date with Beach's Castle! Away I fly! Yeah. And away I fly too! Oh no, not the pipes! Well, that's one way to break up a meeting. Ah ha 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 ha! Ah ha ha ha! We all have a good laugh. And nothing wrong is possibly happening at all in the meantime. Seems like it's pretty much adjourned, by Boogity. Oh, I wanted to say meeting adjourned. Oh uh, well. Ah ha 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 ha! Ah ha 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 ha! Should we cancel it? Huh, <laughs> young man! We're facing a national emergency. We can never leave! If we cancel the meeting, nothing will get solved. We have to bring everyone back, get a new podium, and fix that uh, projector screen that's been broken. All on the double. Also, we need a brand new table. Absolutely. The blurbs are more pressing than even Bowser. The meeting must go on. Mercy, you are the princess. Oh, your wisdom to make us toil even longer is always so wise. Take heed, gentlemen, and star. Arr, that's our word. That's how one gets things done. Ha, 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 ha. All right, I, I've, I've used that joke enough. I keep thinking it's going to end with them all laughing. <laughs> but surely we can't use this ravaged room anymore. Shall we continue someplace a touch less demolished? <laughs> okay, I'm stopping now. Away we walk. No, not Mario, not Peach, not Starlo! Oh, I'm taking the statues with me. I guess I'm not taking the statues. I missed someone. Luigi! Luigi, you can do it! He's, he's trying to swim further. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Oh, ha, 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 I have victory! As easy as bread sandwiches! Fawful's lines are all wonderful and amazing, and I love them. This is amazing, this is an amazing line. It is as easy as a bread sandwich. You know how easy a bread sandwich is? Put down bread, put down another bread, bam, sandwich done. And now for the proceeding with the plan I have planned! Midbus, come! Fawful calls you! Of course, Lord Fawful. I'll give him a New York coffee talk accent. Oh, I don't want to watch this. I don't want to watch this. I don't want to watch. You, you, you can watch this. Okay, I think it's over. Okay, I, you know that I skipped it the first time I played this game. I don't want to play it. I, I don't want to. I don't want to watch that scene. Okay. Still not fully over my fear. He looks up and Bowser is just there. And now we begin this. Okay. So I looked away a little bit uh, sooner than I did the first time I had ever played this. Still, I still don't want to ever see that scene of Bowser eating eating them. That that just is too much for me. Oh, 
But so we begin the game. Now, before we, we actually start off on anything, I must say, um... Normally, I would be much more scared of this. In the, this area, I don't really care for... Or, I would not care for the red too much. But... Alright, so... The way this game was made is that they carefully engineered the shape of everything and the color of everything so that this way it would be as appealing as possible to be seen uh, for an extended period of time. Because they knew that if you're playing a game and you're inside Bowser, like it's not like it's going to be a level in a game where you just finish it and just be done where they could make it gross, you're spending the entire game in here, and they knew people wouldn't want to be grossed out. So they wanted to make it look as good as, as possible. And the what they did to engineer this, I don't even know how the science all works. But everything they did stops me from cowering in fear being sick to my stomach and everything making me feel bad. Besides that first scene there, which I still can't watch. Uh, this is okay. I'm okay with this. Maybe it's the fact that it kind of feels like it's kind of... Oh, th this area, I'm, I'm so used to this game by this point that uh, I'm okay with this. This area, the first area, kind of uh, spooked me a little bit. Because I don't care for the the way that the reds are here. And uh, all the, the squishy mush in the background is kind of gross. But all of this is okay. Also, Mario is floating here if you... There we go. Mario just learned tele... Teleflotation. I didn't... I messed up what the word was. So this is the very first area of the game that is inside Bowser. Come on, camera, you can focus. There we go. So I just want to point out some things. First off, first and foremost, super, super important thing here. The background does not move. It is completely still. I could stay here for as long as I wanted and nothing is moving. Occasionally Bowser will shiver up here on the top screen, which is cool. I love that for added effect. Can't really see it too much. Nothing in here is moving. This is a wonderful good thing. I think that something about having control over the situation makes me feel better because nothing on the screen is moving. Everything feels like it's just completely still and solid and safe. I'm okay. I'm okay. It's amazing. It's, it's wonderful. I'm okay with this. For some reason, this music track here... I don't know why, but there's always a weird, like, <sighs> that happens in the background of this track. I don't know why. I Do they do that specifically? I, I don't know why they do that. I like this song as well. I have been able to memorize this one, though, so I can't sing along to it. Also, there's just a pipe inside the ground. I don't know why. It's just kind of, like, squished inside inside this. The other things are kind of stuck to it. Uh, anatomically, I think this is technically Bowser's intestine, because I remember reading on the Mario Wiki years ago that every spot correlated to another, like, um, part inside the body. When I was first playing this game, I didn't realize there was a correlation. Uh, not, I, I had read it after the fact, and now I can uh, understand that. I'm not cowering! I'm okay! Yay! Also, this just this wood here just stabs right into the, the side. It looks painful, but it, it's okay, I guess. Save with the rocks. You can't get any of these mushrooms, unfortunately. Ah, well. Okay. We're off. Okay. So, here's another important part of the game. Another good thing. The only thing on this screen moving is this. This and all other fluids inside Bowser that are not water um, and butt juice. Yes, this is a very silly game. We'll get to that later. But the only other liquid in this entire game is this, and it's mucus. And didn't care much for it as a kid. Kind of gross. They could have made it a lot worse. Uh... 
To me, it just kind of reminded me of oatmeal. Or, like, porridge, cream of wheat, which I am okay with. So, I don't know how they did it. And it's sort of like quicksand, and it essentially works like quicksand that you just pop up from. Here, let me show you. If you accidentally fall into it, you just fall out through another pipe. There's no... you take no damage. It just resets the area for you, essentially. This was such a wonderful peace of mind thing. Especially growing up and being, like, afraid of that, essentially. To just be like, oh no, I fell in liquids inside the body. Oh, no, no problem. You come out perfectly dry. No problems at all. You're safe. Also, the pipes in there look kind of weird. Not a big fan of the pipes in the game, but I am okay with it. Enough. Oh, look at that. Mario is floating again. I love doing this with the hitboxes. Oops. I fell down. Nice and safe. Also, if you look down, look down out here quickly. There's also a little pattern here of, like, whatever that is. I'm okay with that. This feels... I think the fact that it feels more like an alien world than inside Bowser is something that really helps me to be able to get through this a lot easier. Because I'm okay with Rick and Morty. But, uh... Cause, oh, part of it is, if it's done creatively enough, then... I'm a bit better with it. So I was... Okay, I was okay with the Rick and Morty episode... Where, like, Morty goes into the homeless guy when Rick is building Anatomy Park and everything. It was silly and crazy enough, then... For some reason, I was okay with it. Rick and Morty is already kind of a gross show, so I was like, Okay, it's just kind of one more gross thing. And they were okay with it, actually. Uh, for, for some reason, I was able to get through that alright. Um, this, however, I... Th this is a great game. I love this world. They did a magnificent job, and I cannot thank... Alpha Dream enough for the wonderful job they did on this game. It's taken me a while, and anybody who's steer still here with me during this series, thank you very much. Oh no, I fell. I'm, uh, I'm okay. No problem. And Mario's head kind of falls off a little bit when he's about to, uh, or when he's falling down the pipe as well. Time to get an item. Ooh, multiple coins. Yes, always gotta be ready for these. Otherwise, you'll miss out on a coin. And these item blocks, they look a bit different than the ones from the upper world, but they're just solid, regular blocks. And these are just regular, solid platforms, probably made of rock. Oh no, I fell! But look at that, there was a secret there! I like how some of the game hides its secrets. For example, there you go. A very, it's a very easy, basic secret. But, uh, it's the beginning of the game, so, you know, it's okay. We earned three mushrooms. That will help give us some extra health. It's a health potion in this game. Oh, it's the Savoglobin. They disappear when you come back to this area. There's only one Globin that returns. Hey, ya buddy. What in the name of Globin? Strange to meet you, old visitor. Ha-ha! <laughs> I'm Mickey Mouse! I mean, Mickey Globin! Globin? I always thought that they kind of reminded me of, um... PictoChat on the uh, DS Lite. I don't know why, they just kind of reminded me of PictoChat for some reason. Some call me Emo Globin! Of secret-ish things! Oh, in the body of Bowser! I know them all! I can impart this knowledge to you, if you have the Globin! Oh, ho! I say Globin a lot. Globin? And I have emo Globin brethren. Hit them, oh jumpish creature. Ha <laughs> ha. Being struck brothers is none. Oh, being struck bothers us none. For such is the way of Globin. I always thought Globin was like the religion of their game. It's actually because they're based off of hemoglobin. Uh, which is what, why, why they say Globin. I didn't know what hemoglobin was when I first played this game, so I thought they were just, like, all part of a cult. And they were like, yes, we're okay with being punched. Tis the way of our religion, the globin. Anyway, oh traveler, what are you curious? The nature of globin? The meaning of globin? Burst. I tell you nothing. 
but I will let you save since your globin reminds me of me. Want to save your globin? Uh, yes. Let's read this. Oh, it's still, uh, they head to an emergency meeting. Oh, right, I think it's it changes when we save. Here we go. Save. Yep. There we are. The trash pit. That's what it's called. Oops. By the way, oh traveler, like all things in life, I am temporary, so be careful-ish. Goodbye, funny globin. Oh, it's so charming. I love all the humor of this game. It's, I love this. The Moglobin with savish qualities. I have savish qualities, but I also disappear soon-ish ones. They also say ish a lot. I love them. I love them so much. Ish, Globin. Globin-ish. Want to save your Globin? Let's read the top. I didn't get to show you that. The trash pit. Mario got inhaled into Bowser's body. Also Luigi. What next? I, l I just love how much this game... It's constantly giving Luigi the, the short end of the stick. It's funny, and makes you love Luigi even more. Alright, Globin, I will find some more of your brethren later on in this level, and then never again. Hey, let me go. Now, release me. I, I have no idea what this thing is. Is it like a bubble jellyfish? Like from Spongebob? I don't know. This part was kind of spooky. Arg. Not how to treat a lady. Yeah, quit it. That tickles. <laughs> quit it. Starlo and Holly. Vo fitting voice. Except Starlo is a little bit, uh, bit meaner than Holly is. Now. I got. I'm gonna save you. I got it. What to do? It's a pipe. Globin. Oh, I'm a wandering emo Globin. I come bearing knowledge. Knowledge! Oh, strange pipish thing I see. How I long to press down upon you to sink it down below. But I cannot, for I am just Globin. I also thought it was kind of gross how the pipes uh, have like a casing around them. Kind of gross, but also, at the same time, I'm okay with this. Not, not because, like, oh, I like it, but because, like, I'm, I'm actually okay with this. Uh, let us proceed. For then I might fly skyward, or perhaps travel to far places. There are many pipish types. Oh, traveler, when you find a pipish thing, please press down. Remember, or forever hold your globin. See you, globin. I'm gonna save. The battery is almost a dead, and this episode should end. Some call me Emma. Ah, I can't keep doing that high-pitched voice. What voice should I give the Emma Globin instead? I don't know. The Emma Globins say a whole lot of things. Uh, I think I think I'll keep the Mickey Mouse voice. Ah well, you've you've read this already. Yes, yeah, save the game. Uh, the battery on the camera is almost dead. I'm actually really worried about the camera battery. It's dying a lot faster than uh, it used to. Uh, I still have a little bit of time. I'm running out of memory space on the camera though, so I think this is a good place to uh, end it. Call it quits. Uh, just to let you know, I've been recording for over an hour and 33 minutes, and I have only 30, 31 coins. This is taking even longer than when I was actually playing through this game myself. Okay, save and quit. We shall resume this again. Shortly. One more. <laughs> Alright. Well, I believe it's that time again, friends. It, where's my eyes? Here are my eyes. You can't really see me, I'm just a silhouette. Anyway, I believe it's that time again. If you like what I do, don't be shy to give a thumbs up. Yeah. Have a pleasant day, everyone. And this is Handington, signing off. Bye! Oh, there we go. Bye.